We still want the money. The little boy's all right. What a lie. Come to this phone, I think on 207th and somewhere up, to, up in the Dykeman area. Be at this phone booth at such and such time. We're going to call you and tell you what to do. Rich take the letter and give it to the feds. And he should have kept up with the feds and got his brother. So they say, okay, we need you to go to the phone booth at this time. Rich don't want to go. To my knowledge, to my knowledge, I believe this is what Pat told me, that she dressed like a boy and they took her up to the phone. But the uncle there seeing all this, the phone never rings. The phone never rings. Right. And they ultimately find the little boy's body. Of course. Rich got the 30 keys now. A whole month after his brother bleed out? A whole he month? Out. Wow. Get rid of these phones, bro. Out for moving out of town. Feds all over New York. Which can't you can't move right now. Nobody can't do nothing. He gave them the Alpo to take out of town. Alpo kills Rich. A whole month after. And nobody now, right. caught on. Now the kidnappers. I'm going to kill Rich, place them up in Orchard Beach. A right? whole month after my AZ. City cop, my city out. The kidnappers, I guess, it was just, it was just me thinking for them. Lying Damn. for them. We fucked, they killed Rich. A whole month after. We fucked up now. Notice how AZ said, they sent a letter saying that the little boy is okay. How the little boy is okay when he's been bleeding out his finger that they cut off. The police report says the little boy needs medical attention. Hurry up. AZ lied on Alpo because of him trying to get attention off of Alpo getting all the attention. If Alpo was such a monster. Why he never did anything negative to AZ. AZ had way more money than Alpo, and Alpo never tried to rob him. People got to catch on. Why will Fritz give Rich Porter those keys a whole month after the kidnapping? So he gave it to him on January 4th, and they're still going to wait more days to get rid of it? Y'all got to put it all together. And what I don't like about AZ, Vlad was going to go on with the interview. And he's like, pause, trying to act like Alpo interfere with the kidnapping. But the date was December 5th and Alpo killed Rich January 4th. So it's making me think that Alpo said, wait a minute. He's not getting his little brother. He stole $300,000 from me. He's talking to the feds. Come on, why Rich Porter did not complete the job with the feds to get his brother? He spoke to the feds in the beginning of December and January 4th, he just waited automatically for Fritz to give him bricks. Come on, it doesn't add up, doesn't add up. And one thing I don't like is lies because who's gonna send a letter saying your brother's all right when your brother's bleeding out? So AZ, the police report shows that AZ lied. AZ was talking to the feds on his case. F Rich Porter was talking to the feds, but didn't complete the job, which he should have, because he would have got his brother back. Alpo Martinez, through the whole, pro through the whole interference with the kidnapping, had nothing to do with it, because he was out of town. Everybody puts all the blame on Alpo. Where's the blame on the uncle, on Apple, that did all the grimy stuff? Why nobody's putting the, all the, the hate towards that man that kidnapped his nephew? But they're trying to switch it up on Alpo because Alpo gets all the attention for the fly guy 
and all these people are jealous. But AZ lied, saying that the little boys are right and nobody caught on. And then why will Frist give him work a whole month after? A whole month after Rich Porter left his little brother bleed out a whole month, including Christmas and New Year's. AZ got caught lying and he just is something, a jealousy with Alpo to say that Alpo interfere by get, taking the bricks. Come on. The movies are lying the whole way as well. Sad. The only one that suffer here is Donnell Porter. Rest in peace to Donnell Porter. I wish you had a family that would have helped get you back. Rest in peace.